In this tutorial, uh, I will show you how you can install Ubuntu 17.04 in VirtualBox. To do this, you have to first install the Oracle VM VirtualBox Manager and the ISO image of Ubuntu 17.04. For this, uh, you have to go for www.virtualbox.org slash wiki slash downloads and click on the Windows host link to download the file if you click it then this uh, dialog box will appear and just click the save file to download the file i have already downloaded and installed the virtual box after installation uh, the software will be look like this and next step is to download the iso image of ubuntu 17.04 if you click uh, or type download uh, Ubuntu 17.04 in Google search then uh, this page will appear and uh, you can download the ISO file from this link or direct ubuntu.com site. If you click on this link then this page will appear and depends on your machine configuration you have to download the ISO file. For 64 bit machine click on this link for 32 bit machine click on this link. And if you want to download from ubuntu.com, then click on this link and this, uh, I just click here. Then this page will appear and you have to click on the download button. Uh, before uh, downloading, you have to check your system configuration match with this requirement. 2GB dual core processor, minimum 2GB system memory, 25GB of free hard disk space. And when we click on the download link, then this page will appear and just click on not now, take me to download to go to the download page. And click this link and download the file. I have already downloaded the file and after download, you will get this file even to 17.04 desktop image. Now you can start the installation process. Click on the new button and uh, set a name for the operating system. I am going to 17. Next, set the memory size. I am setting here 45 MB RAM. Next, create. Next, next. Uh, set the default location for your uh, installation folder uh, you can uh, use this default location or you can set it by click this folder and I am using drive D here so, and uh, set the hard disk size for the operating system create our initial setup is uh, ready now go for setting click on storage and uh, choose the ISO image file and this is our image file ok now you can start the installation process Okay, the installation is started. Here, uh, two options is uh, there is two options try Ubuntu and install Ubuntu. Try Ubuntu is to just check the Ubuntu environment uh, without installing this operating system, and uh, install Ubuntu is to install this and use it. Uh, I am going for install Ubuntu. Uh, keep this uh, option unchecked and click continue select something else continue now uh, create your new partition table for this click here and when this dialog box appear click continue 
select the free space and add your root add your root partition root symbol okay our root partition is created and the remaining part of the dx will be used as swap partition plus select the swap area okay now click on install now if this window appears just click continue now the select the location of your area I am choosing here Jaka okay now continue this is the default keyboard layout I will not change it keep it English USA and English USA and uh, name of your uh, here type the username that you will use to log in open the 17 set your password and remember this if you forget this password then you are not able to log in your system uh, I'm choosing a login automatically click continue and here you have to wait for some time to complete the installation process okay our installation is completed now you have to restart the system click on restart now press enter One of the common problem of Ubuntu 17.04 is that uh, the internet connection uh, many times the internet connection not works properly. In my next tutorial I will show you how we can solve that problem. Goodbye for now.